In order to promote her new musical companion film This Is Me, Jennifer Lopez has been performing press appearances. She now disclosed that Khloe Kardashian declined a part. The 54-year-old Lopez has been doing press for her musical film, which will be released on February 16 along with the record of the same name. She disclosed that she had approached a number of Hollywood celebrities about jobs, but that some had declined, including Khloe Kardashian. The 39-year-old's potential position in the movie is unknown, and as of right now, Khloe hasn't discussed it or shared anything on social media. The news also coincides with Lopez's recent admission that she contributed her personal funds to the movie's production, as this new Variety article reveals, she paid over $20 million. Regarding Kardashian and others declining parts for the movie, she acknowledged that many people dislike being in the spotlight, even members of the Kardashian family, who are arguably the most photographed family in the world. People are afraid to show who they are. I understand. It was quite a while for me. I'm terrified. However, Lopez said, the key to my entire f asterisk 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 ing career is not acting like I'm scared. Though all of Chloe's roles have been her playing herself, if she had accepted a part in the movie, it would have been her first acting role in almost 10 years. She made cameo appearances as herself in three episodes of television shows, Real Husbands of Hollywood on BET in 2013, Law and Order. Los Angeles on NBC for a brief period of time in 2011, and Royal Pains on USA Network in 2014. She also starred in the 2019 miniseries for Schemes, which promoted her sister Kim Kardashian's shapewear brand, and the 2014 short film Pnotic Sparkle. Lopez also disclosed that she contributed $20 million of her own funds to the production of the movie This Is Me, as well as the album This Is Me. Now. The documentary The Greatest Love Story and Never Told Comes Last, followed by a love story. The documentary will be available on February 27. The record and its musical companion video will be available for purchase on February 16. Affleck called the love letters Lopez received from him, The Greatest Love Story and Never Told. Lopez invited artists to record the CD in her home theater. Years ago, Lopez's longtime producing partner Elaine Goldsmith Thomas said that J.Lo had informed her that the project would cost $20 million of her alleged $400 million net worth. She's saying, I think I'm going to finance this myself, and I'm in New York. I said to myself, wait, what? Recalls Goldsmith Thomas. I have no idea what it is at all. How are you spending your time? I was concerned. How come you telling us your story? It's too intimate. Put an end to it. I felt uncomfortable for her, she said. Although Goldsmith Thomas acknowledged that she was petrified the whole time, she never felt completely at ease with the idea. Nevertheless, she now knows why. I was worried that as she described her path, it would appear to be saying, this is my journey from Ben to Ben. And that is not the point. It's about, here's what I've been through for the past 20 years, and I kept walking into the same wall and blaming the wall until I started to look at myself, stated Goldsmith Thomas.